We are looking at criterion C, which is worth three marks, and it's all about personal engagement. I've got eight fun ways that you can inject some personal engagement into your Mass IA. Way number one is to create an experiment. I mentioned before a student of mine this year was comparing two different balls, a tennis ball and a paddle ball. She created an experiment where she dropped them both from the same height and used an app called Tracker that made, that took 400 data points to measure the trajectory of the balls. That was super cool. Step two is to create a simulation. A student this year really loves F1 driving and he wanted to look at the most efficient way, the fastest way to drive through a certain type of curve called a chick in. I think I said that right. And he contacted a sim driver, which is someone that drives using, that drives a virtual simulator of a racing car driver and exported all the data to a program. Another student was looking at how ions diffuse after being fired by a neuron and he created a computer program that started with, you could change the input of the amount of ions you started with, and each time the probability of going to the left or to the right, diffusing to the left or the right, was a half. And that was super cool, and that gave him lots of data to work with to analyze. The third cool way is to create some handmade diagrams. So I had a student last year, she was an art student as well, she was investigating the dragon's curve, and she used her apple pencil and an iPad to follow the algorithm and create these most beautiful diagrams of the fractals. Another student was looking at how lines become smoothed in 3D modeling, for example, like the Pixar movies or the Disney movies. And he had a really basic example where he started with an arrow shape like this, and he applied the algorithm three or four times, annotating the diagram as he went to show how you could smooth that into a curve. Very cool. Our fourth example is to create a function. The student that we talked about previously that was looking at the tennis ball and the paddle ball, she created a function that measured every single bounce. So she used a piecewise function because each bounce had a different function. I saw another IA that was looking at the plan view of a roller coaster and she used a different function to model each stage of the roller coaster and put them all together for a piecewise function. So creating your own function. The next idea, the fifth idea, is to make and test predictions. So my student this year that looked at the Gini coefficient and how income inequality affected votes for Brexit, he started by saying, I think that the higher the income inequality is in a region, the higher the votes for Brexit will be, because he surmised that if there was a higher level of income inequality, that would make people feel discontent, disenfranchised, and they'd be more likely to vote for Brexit, elicit some change in their local area. I have a sixth idea, which is to do some independent research. This year, a student is making an IA all about insurance claims and how they work. Now, she is an AA student, but she looked at Markov chains and specifically did her probabilities using Poisson distribution. And neither of those things are in the AA course. They're actually in the AI course, but not the AA course. So she did a, a huge amount of research. All of that independent research would improve her criterion C grade. Idea number seven to boost your criterion grade is to create your own proofs. I had a student this year that was looking at the unit circle and the roots of unity, and he made four proofs relating to the roots being plotted on the unit circle that were completely individual only to him. So I really thought that was amazing. My last tip, my eighth tip, is to be original. Any IA that's a variation of a textbook IA or an IA that has been done a lot of times, for example, the birthday, pro uh, the birthday problem, COVID calculations, is never going to score very well in Criterion C because it's not original. You want to be creative and find an IA that's going to be personal and specific to you. I hope you found those eight ideas helpful. You might not be able to do all of them, but try and inject some of them into your IA and you're gonna see a boost in your Criterion C grade.